Hey everyone, this is Michael and nice to have you back here on my channel where everything is about digital art painting in a painterly style and today I want to show you how I've painted this Italian landscape painting and of course once again with the help of the amazing MA brushes which are made especially for such cases where you as a digital artist want to dig into digital art but also remain a traditional painting style. This painting here was not recorded by purpose. I was just simply painting in Photoshop and trying shapes and colors and suddenly I've seen that the outcome might be good. So I've tried to recollect the history of Photoshop and put this together to a movie. And here right now you can see me how I've tried to repaint the beginning of it so you can get a good impression how I've started. You can see at the right side the final painting already and it just has different forms and shapes. This is the way I've built that painting out of my imagination. Like really having no clue and no plan where to go but starting with the right colors and some first shapes. And I'm using very strongly here the power of imagination and I am trying and testing around to bring interesting shapes into this landscape painting. As an experienced landscape painter and observer you will know some basic forms and shapes are always mountains and hills, trees or bigger trees like the two you can see at the background and of course a nice pathway that leads to a nice place somewhere. So use those elements to build your landscape. I'm color correcting here now the scene and for this I'm using already a part of the MA colors that will be released soon. This here is just a small part of it but it's an amazing part. With different actions you can have with one click seven traditional style painting color schemes on your painting or on your photograph image. You can see immediately how your photograph or your photo reference would look like with traditional colors in a very old style. And then of course you can use them for your painting. This is just a small part of the MA colors, just a bonus and it's a very nice one, a fun part of it but very useful also. The MA colors will contain dozens of digital color palettes of landscape artworks of the old masters but also of new modern painters, really just the collection of the best of the best. And those are ready for you directly to paint in Photoshop. And you will also have reference images so you can already see and understand what the result of your painting would look like. Those are hand painted paintings. The aim is that with those colors in your hand you can go for your painting, for your ideas immediately. You don't have to look up for references, you will have already the right tones. And what I mean is those special ones, those great ones of the best painters. That left part with the tree is the part that I have not recorded. It's really created very quickly and very fast with always the same brush. It's MA brush 12-6. And this brush is really doing magic. You can paint the stones with it, the pathway, the grass and I was even painting the clouds and the whole background with the same brush. You really can use any brush of the category 12 or 15, the brushes for the tree and the fan brushes to build such a landscape painting in a short time. So here is a quick summary of this painting. Paint first the background, the sky, then later paint the background in a bluish tone because this will indicate the distance to the foreground here which is caused by the atmospheric light. 
Next come to the foreground and the area in the middle. The foreground will have saturated green colors in this case and the middle area they will be in between the blue tones and the green tones and slightly to the gray. Everything seems so easy but you know it and it's fact. Those paintings are really hard and they are not easy. They need experience and patience and interest and maybe a good teacher. Maybe I can be your teacher. On my website you can find different courses that I'm offering for you. They are not so expensive but really detailed and with narration by me. I hope you could Take a little bit from this one with you. It was not so much a tutorial, but more something to watch over my shoulder, how it was created. I'm still happy I have recorded the process a little bit. Thank you for being again with me today. And it would really be helpful for the video if you can give it a thumb up. Thank you very much. Till the next time. Bye bye.